Assalamualaikum. My name is Mahmoud Sadir, and you are watching Introduction of Biology with Mahmoud Sadir. Stay at home and stay safe in this pandemic. We have started chapter number four, in which today we start a new topic that is passage of molecules into and out of the cell. Before starting the lecture, if you are new on my channel, please subscribe to my channel so you can get my latest videos. So let's go to the screen. First, we study about the introduction that cell membrane act as barrier to most, but not all membranes. It means that the cell membrane allows all the uh, molecules for pass through it according to the uh, cell. That's why cell membrane is also called semi-permeable membrane. Cell membrane maintain equilibrium inside as well as outside the exchanging, uh, as well as uh, outside by exchanging with cell environment according to the need of the cell. Cell membrane maintain equilibrium inside and outside the cell by uh, exchanging the uh, matter within cell and uh, outside the cell. Cell membrane do this function by the following phenomena. These phenomena are the, uh, this. First is uh, diffusion, second facilitated diffusion, third is osmosis, fifth is filtration, sixth is active transport, seventh is uh, endocytosis, and last is exocytosis. Today we only read the first uh, diffusion uh, because this is little bit uh, long. So, so let's start to study the diffusion. First, we study about the definition of diffusion. That diffusion is the movement of molecules from higher concentration to lower concentration, means high to low. Now, there is an ex explanation of diffusion that the molecule of any substance, no matter it is solid or liquid or gas, are in motion, but when when that substance is above from 0 degree Kelvin not Celsius 0 degree Kelvin or minus 273 degree Celsius when they are in position of motion they are in position of motion when they are uh, above of 0 degree Kelvin or minus 273 de degree Celsius no matter it is solid liquid or gas in a substance Majority of the molecules move from higher to lower concentration, but some of the molecules that move from low to high. Eventually, uh, uh, most of the molecules uh, <coughs> move from higher to lower concentration, but some of the molecules move from low to high. But there is a question that molecules move continuously. The answer is the molecules are continuously moving high to low concentration, but till then they reach the state of equilibrium that the uh, high higher concentration to lower concentration they are continuously moving but till they are uh, it takes the position of equilibrium uh, after equilibrium they stop the uh, uh, moving from higher concentration to the lower concentration <coughs> now we study that where and where the function of diffusion is used. Diffusion is one principal method of movement of substance within cell as well as the outside of the cell. Diffusion is one of the principal method of movement of substance within cell as well as the outside of the cell. The second place where the process of diffusion is used is carbon dioxide, oxygen, glucose, etc. Carbon dioxide, oxygen, glucose, etc. can cross cell membranes by diffusion. This is the second place where the diffusion is used. The third place where the diffusion is used is the gas exchange in gills and lungs across by the process of diffusion. Gas exchange across the uh, in uh, gills and lungs. The, uh, this is occurred by the diffusion. The fourth and the last function of the diffusion is uh, place where the diffusion is used is 
मूवमेंट ऑफ ग्लूकोज मोलिक्यूल फ्रॉम स्मॉल इंटेस्टाइन ल्यूमन इन टू द ब्लड कैपलेज ऑफ विली इज एनदर एग्जाम्पल दिस इज अ वेरी इंटेस्टाइन ल्यूमन स्मॉल इंटेस्टाइन ल्यूमन इन टू द ब्लड कैपलेज ऑफ विलाई दीज ब्लड स्मॉल अबाउट दिस स्मॉल इंटेस्टाइन एंड द ब्लड कैपलेज ऑफ विलाई दीज ऑल थिंग वो स्टडी इन द चैप्टर नंबर नाइन लास्ट चैप्टर ऑफ द बुक्स वो स्टडी अबाउट दीज थिंग अबाउट दीज थिंग्स इन आवर लास्ट चैप्टर ठीक इज एनदर एग्जाम्पल ऑफ डिफिन नाउ देर इज द लास्ट क्वेश्चन दैट आवर देन आवर टू डेज लेक्चर इज फिनिश दिस क्वेश्चन इज दैट द where the why diffusion is type of passive transport the answer is that because a cell does not expand energy when molecules diffuse across its membrane that's why diffusion is the type of passive transport again i repeat the answer because a cell does not expand energy when molecules diffuse across its membrane that's why the diffusion is the type of cell membrane this is the diagram of uh, diffusion we can in in this diagram we can see that the uh, molecules move from higher concentration to the lower concentration when they are moving uh, they are moving from higher concentration to the lower concentration then uh, in the uh, last uh, part we can see that they are uh, stay takes in the position of equilibrium first is uh, uh, di molecules water molecules high concentration to the lower concentration next is movement of low concentration high concentration low concentration next is equilibrium when they takes the position of equilibrium okay so that's all our today's lecture is finished if you like my video please like it and if you have any query about this topic please tell me in comment once again if you are new on my channel please subscribe to my channel so you can get my latest videos so we'll meet on the next lecture till then allah hafiz